Is your Roblox still lagging or stuck on low FPS in 2025? Don't worry. In this video, I'll show you the updated block strap settings you need to use this year to boost FPS, fix lag, and make Roblox run smoother than ever. So stick around till the end because I'll also share the best hidden fast lags that can give you an extra edge in your gameplay. Let's jump right in. Gear Up Booster is a great tool that helps reduce your ping while playing games, and it works with both wired and wireless connections. Download it safely from the official website using the link in the description and enjoy with lower ping. Step 1. Turn off power throttling in Windows to help Roblox run smoother. If your computer is low-end or budget, it needs to run at full power for games like Roblox. But Windows has a feature called Power Throttling, which tries to save energy by slowing down your CPU. To do this, press Windows plus R on your keyboard. This opens a small box called Run. In that box, type gpedit.msc and press Enter. This will open the Local Group Policy Editor, which is a tool to change important system settings. Now follow these steps. Click Computer Configuration. Then go to Administrative Templates, then click System Scroll Down and click Power Management. On the right side, find Power Throttling Settings and double-click it. A new window will open. Inside that, double-click Turn Off Power Throttling. Another window will appear. Select the Enabled option, then click Apply and OK. Now, Power Throttling is completely disabled. This means your CPU will always stay at full speed, giving you smoother gameplay, fewer FPS drops, and less lag in Roblox or any other game. Step 2. Make Roblox use CPU better with Run with Affinity tool. You can get all the files from my official website. I give link in the description of this video. Now that your CPU is fully unlocked, let's make sure Roblox is actually using all of it. We'll use a tool called Run with Affinity, which forces Roblox to use the full power of your processor every time you open it. Open the Run with Affinity tool. Go to the Affinity tab. There, click the three dots to browse for a file. Find and select Roblox PlayerLauncher.exe, which is the file that starts Roblox. You'll usually find it in app data greater than local, greater than Roblox. After selecting the launcher, you'll see a section called Set Affinity. From the dropdown, choose the highest number available. This number matches your CPU threads. Selecting the highest number makes Roblox use every CPU thread for better FPS. In the shortcut name box, type something like High Performance Roblox so it's easy to recognize. Under the Run dropdown, choose Maximized so Roblox launches in full screen mode. Click Create Shortcut to add this version of Roblox to your desktop. From now on, always use this shortcut to start Roblox. You can also click Run Program to test it right away. This tool makes Roblox use the full CPU every time, which gives smoother gameplay, higher FPS, and less lag, especially if you're on a weaker or older PC. Step 3. Updated Secret Block Strap. Fast flags to boost Roblox FPS for low-end PCs. You can get all the files from my official website. I give link in the description of this video. In this step, we'll use a tool called Block Strap, which unlocks hidden Roblox settings called Fast Flags. These control graphics, physics, and performance. Using optimized flags can greatly boost FPS on low-end PCS. First, go to your FPS Boost Pack and find Block Strap Launcher. Download and install it like any normal app. Once installed, press the Windows key, search for Block Strap, and open it. Inside, click Configure Settings, then go to the Engine Fast Flag Settings tab. Scroll down to Fast Flags. Click the button that says I know what I'm doing, then click Add New. Now, open the text file in your FPS Boost Pack with the Fast Flag settings. There are multiple presets, but the one called Updated Secret Fast Flag Graphics is the best balanced. It boosts FPS, but still keeps the game looking good. Only use the Ultra Low preset if your PC is really weak. Copy everything from that file and paste it into Blockstrap's Fast Flag section. Click OK, and if a message appears, just click Yes. Save your settings and close Blockstrap. Now, launch Roblox. You'll notice smoother gameplay, faster FPS, and fewer stutters, especially in heavy games like Arsenal or Brookhaven. In this step, I'm going to show you a helpful tool that can make your Roblox connection more stable. First, download the Gear Up Booster tool from its official website. I've added the official link in the description. After downloading, install it on your PC. The first thing you'll need to do is sign in with either your Facebook or Google account. On the Home tab, you'll find all the games installed on your PC. If you go to the Games tab, you can also browse through thousands of games available for optimization. To improve your network and FPS, go back to the Home tab and select the game you want to boost. For example, I'll select Roblox, click the Boost button, and the tool will automatically start optimizing the game by finding the most suitable server for you. Next, choose your server region. Always select the nearest server for the most stable connection. 
In my case, the Middle East server works best. Now, go to the End tab where you'll see a list of servers available in your region. You can either choose the nearest one manually or let GearUp automatically pick the best option. For the best results, I recommend keeping it on automatic. Finally, close the window and launch your game using GearUp Booster. Step 4. Use Throttle Stop to improve CPU speed. You can get all the files from my official website. I give link in the description of this video. Sometimes, Windows slows down your CPU to save power, which can cause lag spikes in Roblox. To fix this, we'll use a tool called Throttle Stop that keeps your CPU running fast and steady during gaming. Open your FPS Boost Pack Tools folder, then open the Throttle Stop folder. Double-click throttlestop.exe to launch it. You'll see different modes like performance, game, internet, and battery. Choose the game mode for the best results. Then check the box for high performance to unlock full CPU power. You'll also see advanced settings like clock mode and speed shift. Ignore these unless you know what you're doing. Check the box for disable turbo. This helps prevent overheating but still keeps performance strong. Then click. Turn on and click save so your settings are always applied. Keep throttle stop running in the background when you play Roblox. This will stop your CPU from slowing down and give you stable FPS for longer gaming sessions. Step 5. Use MSI Utility to improve communication between hardware. You can get all the files from my official website. I give link in the description of this video. Your GPU and CPU need to work together quickly for smooth gameplay. To make them respond faster, we'll use MSI Utility V3, which reduces lag and improves input response. Open MSI Utility V3 from your FPS Boost Pack. A list of devices will appear. Find your graphics card in the list. NVIDIA, AMD, or Intel graphics. Tick the MSI checkbox, then change interrupt priority to high. If you also see Intel HD graphics or integrated graphics, do the same. Check the box and set it to high. Click apply and close the tool. These changes make your GPU respond faster, reduce stutters, and give smoother performance when playing Roblox. Step 6. Free up RAM with ISLC, Intelligent Standby List Cleaner. You can get all the files from my official website. I give link in the description of this video. RAM is your computer's short-term memory. When it gets too full, Roblox can stutter and lag. ISLC clears unused memory, so Roblox always has enough to run smoothly. Open the ISLC app from your Tools folder. At the top, you'll see your total memory, like 16,000 megabytes or 32,000 MB. In the field that says free memory is lower than, type in half your total memory. Example, if 16,000, type 8,000. Now, check these boxes. Start ISLC Minimized Launch. ISLC on user logon. Turn on timer resolution and set it to 0.50. Change the polling rate to 1000. If your PC is very slow, set it to 10,000 instead. Click Stop, then Start, and finally click Purge Standby List. This instantly clears memory and frees up RAM. With ISLC running, Roblox will have more memory available, which improves FPS and prevents freezing. Step 7. Disable useless startup apps for faster boot and gameplay. When your PC starts, many apps open in the background. These apps waste resources and slow down Roblox. We'll disable them. Right-click the taskbar and open Task Manager. Go to the Startup tab. You'll see a list of apps that start automatically. Right-click apps you don't need, like Spotify, Discord, or Adobe, and click Disable. Be careful not to disable important system apps. After that, restart your PC. Now, your computer will start faster and give Roblox more power to run smoothly with higher FPS.